What's going on, it's your boy CJ, aka The Bearded Yurik, and I'm back again with another episode of The Barbershop Files. If you've been here before, thanks for coming back. I really appreciate all your support. If you haven't been here before, welcome. This channel is all about positivity, laughter, and having a good time. If you enjoy the content, make sure you click that subscribe button. It's right down below. Smash that like button, ring that bell, drop me a comment. I really enjoy the interaction. In the meantime, sit back, relax, enjoy this intro, and I'll be right back. Are you ready? And I'm back. Thanks for sticking around. I am here on the road, still in my hotel room, and bringing you another episode of the Barbershop Files. So today, as we talk the title, from a thumbnail, we'll be featuring Barbudo Beard Products. So I actually have a oil bomb combo from them. Um, the Barbershop scent is actually called Porter. Uh, the scent profile that they have listed for that actually is a hot lather shaving cream. Uh, so getting right into these products, um, I have the one ounce oil here. It is a nice amber bottle with the dropper top. Definitely has those water oil resistant labels. You have the company name as well as a cool little image on the front. Come along the side, you have the scent profile name, little viewing window, and then you have your ingredients. Now this oil is definitely on the light to medium side. I'd say probably more closer to the lighter side. And this oil is absolutely phenomenal. So it will run you for $18 on the website. And getting into the carrier blend, it actually is argan oil, avocado oil, jojoba oil, hemp seed oil, rice bran oil, sweet almond oil, vitamin E, and fragrance. Again, broken record um, i seem to really always love an oil and steer towards an oil that has that hemp seed oil in it it just does absolutely amazing things for me for my skin for my beard just so beneficial for the actual beard process the healthier growing of a beard and i absolutely love it so as you can tell i am a big fan of this oil it was very very good for me worked very well so great job um, getting into the balm, this is the balm. It's in the typical screw top tin. Um, got a different actual photo of the guy on the front. Um, so all the pictures on the different products, the balms, the oils, um, all that are different. Um, so, so for the bombs, they're all the same. For the oils, they're all the same. Um, but they do change the colors to kind of signify the different scent profiles. Um, but all the oils do have the picture of this gentleman on it. And then all the bombs have a picture of this gentleman on it. Um, but they do change the colors for the different scent profiles. Um, so yes, this is a two ounce butter. Um, I'm sorry, not butter, balm. It's a two ounce balm. As you can see, I did use it um, a couple times. So this is definitely a, I would say, if you're gonna go to a medium to a, you know, a good hold, to a medium to a, a thick hold, hard hold, this is definitely more towards like the stronger hold side. Um, it's definitely a thicker balm. Um, it does take a lot to kind of dig that out of there. So very nice um, if you're into that. Um, I'm not really looking for that, but this balm is actually very beneficial as well because when you get into the carrier blend for this, it's actually beeswax, cocoa butter, shea butter, lanolin, argan oil, avocado oil, jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, vitamin E oil, glycerin, and fragrance. So I mean, right off the bat, your first ingredient is beeswax. So you know you're definitely gonna get a good hold. Not only is that a good hold, that beeswax also comes into play to kind of help hold all those ingredients together. Um, but it is also very beneficial for your skin. A lot of people don't know that. Beeswax is very, very good for your skin, very beneficial, very, very nutrient enriched and helping out to keep that skin nice and nourished. Also, you can see on there that might stick out to some people is that glycerin. Some people see that and they get scared thinking that it's not good, but that glycerin is actually good because that glycerin does attract moisture and helps keep your skin hydrated. So that's at the very end. Um, it is good for your skin and it works well. So there's a little bit in there, but not much. So, I mean, if you're looking for a good 
um, hold balm, this is definitely it. You use this, your beard's gonna look like Wayne Static's hair from Static X. I mean, it's gonna be absolutely great. Um, so it worked very, very well. Uh, but like I said, it's very you know beneficial as well because you have all those different ingredients. You have the butters in there, the oils. So it's a very nutrient-packed balm as well. So it's a two ounce, and that's gonna run you for eighteen dollars on the website as well. So getting into that scent profile. Um, the hot lather shaving cream. So initially when you smell this in the bottle, I definitely get that sweet, clean, refreshing um, shaving cream scent. But the really nice thing about it is that they do add that sweetness to it. So it's really, really nice. Um, you warm that up, get it out of bottle, and you do get that kind of barbershop scent as well. So very good job. Um, very, very nice. Again, one of those barbershops that kind of have that twist to it, which is another reason why I think that they kind of don't list it as you know barbershop it's the hot lather shaving cream so it's in that barbershop category and it does have that scent to it but they don't have it specifically labeled as a barbershop so great job um, very very you know impressed with these products um, highly recommend them um, phenomenal phenomenal job with these um, they've been out for a few years so they definitely know what they're doing uh, I will post all their information down below in the description as far as their uh, Instagram their website uh, so that way you can check them out if you have not subscribed to the channel yet and you enjoy the content make sure to do so now you can either click the link down below or there should be something floating around over here for you to click uh, there might be a video over here if you want to check something else out and make sure you tune in for next week thank you